are few sweeter feelings in life, guys, than walking up to the 18th hole with a putt for eagle after you just carried the water on an island green. Well, today we are definitely not doing that. I'm putting for 15, and if you wanna see how I got here, stick around. Hey guys, back out on course. As you see, I'm in a cart, and that's because the Florida summer has hit us. It's really hot, so I've got a cart today. We're testing the Mizuno STZ 3 wood versus my Ping G425 here. We're gonna battle these two out and see which one reigns supreme. Let's do it. All right, so here's the deal. We've got the Ping G425. Now, this is the one that you actually saw me buy on this show. And Mizuno was nice enough to send me their STZ. And if you've been following the channel, you know that Mizuno was one of my favorite drivers of the entire year. Okay guys, so the three wood, I didn't seem to have so much luck inside the simulator environment, but we're gonna see if real life changes that for us. All right guys, so we've got the beautiful STZ here. We're gonna be using the same ball. We always use my official Let's Play Through Balls from EncoreGolf.com, link below. Help support the show and you play an awesome ball. But there we go. We've got the threes today for the STZ and we've got the twos today for the Ping G425. We'll hit a few balls here and see what happens on this shot. There's a bunker up there on the right that I've got to avoid. I want to hit a nice little draw here, which is my normal swing and hopefully we'll be in good shape. Now I've been playing some really good golf, so my swing should be really good. I was just one over on the front nine. That's leaking very far left. Good shot shape though. Might be out of bounds. Estimated carry and roll 242, the club head speed 97. Ball speed 140, smash factor 1.44. Let's hit another one. That's heading a little bit right. Didn't get that draw I wanted. Club head speed 97, ball speed 138, smash factor 1.43. The estimated carry and roll was 238. That's working really nice. Nice and high too. Wow. That's a really good ball. I think it hit the hill too. Estimated carry and roll 243, smash factor 1.46, club head speed 95, ball speed 140. All right, well, one out of three ain't bad, right gang? We got one left, one right, and one was just right. All right, we're gonna move over to the ping G425. We've got the two balls here for this one. Okay. That one again is a little left. It's really drawing. Club head speed 96, ball speed 141, smash factor 1.47, estimated carry and roll 246. Uh oh. That was a terrible swing. <laughs> Club head speed 97, ball speed 140, smash factor 1.44, estimated carry and roll 242, but it definitely did not go that far. Barely got off the ground. Oh, that was low and right. <laughs> what did I say about how good I was swinging? Once again, one really good one, two pretty poor ones. Let's go check them out. Well, what did I say about swinging it really well? <laughs> that was not a good start. It's gonna get better, I promise. All right, we're coming up on one of my pings there, which was not a good shot at all. 183, but the swing was not good either. So I'm kind of lucky that we're not in too bad a shape just off the rough and you know what, I could get to the hole from here. Now here's another pretty poor effort from the ping, but it rolled really nicely. It was really low, barely got off the ground as well, but it did go to 238 just in front of this bunker. There's the green up there. Now we are in the woods here and I think we probably got hung up in the trees. This one went really right. And this is our Mizuno STZ, as you can see, really don't have a shot other than punching out from here. Okay, now we're on the left-hand side. We are flirting with out of bound stakes, as you can see. Neither of these shots are all that great. This was the first one I eat, hit with each of them. This is the Mizuno right here. This is the first Mizuno I actually hit. As you can see, probably have a shot, maybe over that tree. Walking over to here, this is going to be a ping. This is probably my best ping, but look at it. It's left. It's left. It's 231. I'd, I'd be hard pressed to have a good shot there for sure. And here we go 
to our best ball. By far our best ball. Wow. 246 staring right down at it. That's my best Mizuno right there. There's the three on it. I'll take that. You always see some crazy things on the golf course. Here's what's going on here today. Big old trees in this neighborhood. And uh, sometimes they gotta come down, I guess. Make some good firewood. Too bad it's summer is here. I could have used it a couple of months ago. We had some cold snaps, but uh, anyway, on to test number two. All right, we've got another very tight hole. And the reason I picked this side for the three wood battle is everything's tight. You've got water here. If you can see it, we've got water right here all along the right-hand side of this hole. We've got trees all along the left-hand side of this hole. And there's just a very narrow fairway up there. So I often hit three wood here. This is gonna be a really good test. Let's do it. STZ's up for... Oh, that's perfect. Nice and high. Oh, yeah. Oh, I like that one a lot. Oh, another perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Wow. That's a little higher and more of a draw there, but in perfect shape again. Club head speed 97, ball speed 140, smash factor 1.45. I got it a little bit center there. Estimated carry and roll 244. I'll tell you what, those three shots felt and looked perfect. All right, it's ping time. That's a good one. It's drawing a little bit, hit it a little bit off the toe maybe but very forgiving, which is why I like these clubs. Oh, another good one. That's high in drawing. Woo, club head speed 99, ball speed 143, smash factor 1.44. Estimated carry and roll 250. Uh-oh, that one's heading right. This is a bad swing. Club head speed 95, ball speed 140, Smash factor 1.46, estimated carry and roll 242. I promise you didn't get any roll because that's in the water, but that was definitely user error. All right, now I think I can give you a proper first impression. Now that I actually hit some good shots, my swing is back. First of all, the Mizuno feels solid at impact. The ping feels a little bit more buttery and that would be not what I would guess, honestly, because I know the STZ to be a very buttery feeling driver. And of course, Mizuno irons feel like there's that compression on the ball. I will also say the Mizuno, it, while it feels a little bit harder, it's got better feedback. The Mizuno, I think, is a better feeling club, definitely a better sounding club, okay? That's always been a gripe of mine with the pings is, uh, the fact that these things do not sound too good. Now, I'm looking at these balls and you're probably not gonna believe what you're about to see, okay? But both of these clubs, very consistent. All right, we're walking up over here on the left-hand side of the fairway. These are both of my pings here. We've got 229 and just a couple more yards there on the same exact line, 233. So four yards separating those two balls there. And you're not gonna believe here on the other side what the Mizunos look like. Now that's what I call a team right there. Okay, we'll go to the one that's furthest. They're all within five yards of each other. Okay, the furthest away, I should say. This is 228. That's our first Mizuno. You can see the other, there was one ping that went in there as well. And look at these two, gosh. Tell me this club isn't consistent. 232 and still 232. I'm gonna call it 233 though. Look at that. All right, we're standing out here exactly at 230. I need probably 220 to carry the water. This is an island green. 230 to the flag stick. 240 means I've blown past the green. In terms of wind direction, We've got a little bit behind us, but mostly just really left to right, okay? So the wind really won't affect the distance of this shot much. First up is that Mizuno. Let's see if we can hit a green. No. Down. That's one. It's up in the air. It's a pretty good shot, actually, drawing. 
Oh, it's in the water. It's in the water. Let's try that one more time and swing a little harder. The estimated carry was 228. It was two yards from being perfect. Oh, that's another pretty good one. Oh, in the water. Club head speed 100, ball speed 141, smash factor 1.40. Uh, I feel like I really want to like tin cup it right now. Give me one more. Oh, there it is. Come on, that's got to get there. That's got to get there. <laughs> None of them got there. But I gotta say, they would have rolled there if it wasn't an island green. This is a very tough shot. I got it off the ground there three times in a row, so I think I'm a believer, guys. I think this one might be the better club for me in the end, but before we do make that decision, let's see if we can get there with the ping. Sometimes it's the swinger, not the club, guys. That's in the air, nice. Come on. That can't get there, nothing can get there. Yes! <laughs> we got one! We got one! That's on the green, baby. That's the ping, and you can see it just had better trajectory. Just get that club off the ground just a little bit better than the Mizuno. So, if I'm gonna rank these two clubs, they are side by side, guys. I can't pick a winner, so you're gonna have to do it for me. And it's not just because I want you to comment, but I do want you to comment. It's really because I wouldn't be able to choose, honestly. The Mizuno is better off the tee, hands down, feels better, sounds better. The ping, just easier for me to get up off the ground on the fairway when you got a tight lie. So if I'm going to Ireland, I'm going to Scotland, I'm going to Bandon Dunes, I'm going to these Lynx courses on the ocean, I'm absolutely taking the ping. If I'm playing this course, my home course, where I pull three wood quite a bit from the tee, I think I'm going Mizuno. What would you choose? Let me know below. Hey guys, we had a lot of fun out here. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. I, I wish I hit this a little better for you today, but we did our best. And I think we did learn some things here today. I think we learned that the Mizuno is the one for me off the tee and definitely off the fairway. The ping is the winner. I hope you enjoyed this one, guys. I hope you'll come back here for more action on Let's Play Through. A couple times a week, we're putting out these videos, so make sure to hit subscribe, put the notifications on, and I'll see you very soon on another edition of Let's Play Through.